Did you know that 93% of data breaches include phishing? 3 out of 10 of phishing emails are opened. We are at a point where phishing attacks have risen to a level that we haven't seen since the last 5 years. But do you know what is the magic on this? It's human intelligence, of course. That is the best defense against phishing attacks. In this video, you will find out what is a phishing attack, how to recognize such attack and how to defend against it, and how Sophos Home Premium can enhance your security posture. So let's jump into it, shall we? Because this is going to be a good one. Hello everybody, I am George, the blue member of the InfoSec Defenders. We have our own merchandise as you can see. The InfoSec Defenders, if you didn't know, is a YouTube channel made for everyone who wants to be introduced with the latest cyber security threats and trends. So far we have few subscribers and some of them are here. So it's Thomas and Friends characters, that we, the ones that we have. So that's why make sure to subscribe to us in order to, to help you learn how to cyber defend. Before getting into the details, let's first ensure ourselves that we understand what a phishing attack is. Phishing is when someone tries to make someone else into doing something they want, and phishing attacks on the other hand, use social engineering to trick users into giving away the sensitive information. Some of those are usernames, passwords, credit card details, bank account numbers, and more. So, as cybersecurity and cyber criminals is a constant cat and mouse game, the attacks that the cyber criminals do will become more sophisticated, and like that they'll be able to bypass different security mechanisms or filtering measures. One thing that they won't be able to bypass is ourselves, human intelligence. More specifically, you. You might be the one that will be able to defend yourself successfully against phishing attacks and cyber criminals. Now, before we start the demo, I would like you to go down in the comments down below and start a conversation of different phishing attack incidents that you may have experienced in the recent past. Like that, we'll be able to become more wiser, to become a lot smarter, and being able to see what's in the future of phishing attacks. It is demo time. Let's send to Blue a phishing email to see if he takes the bait. <laughs> Oh, it seems like we've got an email. Let's see what it is. Oh, okay. She will so click I have the a link. problem with the system. She will so click the link. I need to put in my personal information. Okay, okay, it looks legit. What are they really telling me all this information in? Sure, sure. But I've been. I hope he submit all information. Type all of these, all of this information in. Okay, type in everything, I don't know. I got you, Blue. Let's see what's going to happen right now. I hope it's something good. Oh my goodness. I've been hacked. I've been hacked. I've been hacked. Oh my goodness. I've been hacked. <laughs> so, let's take a look at what happened just there. And we click on so we click on the email to try to read it. So it says, "Hello, dear customer. Why is it starting with generic salutation? Normally, it's supposed to say hello blue because that's my name or nickname, but still." Um, it says, "Hey there, where you trusted nap? Poor grammar and misspelling. That is not right." With this email, I would like to give you once again your personal information due to system issues. Um, why would they want me to resubmit? or re-verify my personal information? I don't know. Please visit the below mentioned link. Um, why are they so urgent to want me to press it right now? I don't know. It's none of my business. And regards, no name. The Invisible Man. Oh well. Well, I do have the security tools to do what I have to do in order to remove this. 
but for the sake of this demo i'm gonna click on the link and show you what will happen um but i would probably recommend to not try this yourself i do really do normally we're supposed to put it as spam but i'm but i'm just gonna click on the link to for the sake of this demo and again poor grammar and misspelling once again why would they want me to type in all of my personal information why so much basically i'm not gonna type in anything no my friends i'm not gonna type in anything you are all scammers all scammers so that's why i'm gonna leave this site and i'm gonna mark it as a spam organizations will never ever ask you to send your personal information about your usernames, passwords, or credit card numbers. But while human intelligence is the best way of defending ourselves against phishing attacks, there are some security tools that will help us enhance our security posture and have an extra layer of defense. There are many security tools. However, the one that we're gonna be looking at today is Sophos Home Premium which offers a very user-friendly environment for us, more specifically for your home users. So here is the Sophos Home website. Is there something very relevant with today's topic, in this case, phishing attacks? If we go down here to web protection, it says blocks, bad or compromised websites, including phishing sites. Definitely relevant for today's topic. So in the video description below, you will find the link taking you to the sophos.com website where you can read different things about it if you're very interested in it and you can buy it if you'd like and if you do decide to buy it, you will get an additional 30% discount so you will save 30% of the regular price which is pretty cool because this is a great opportunity for you to protect yourself against phishing attacks and different cybersecurity threats so that was it for today's video. If you did enjoy it, be sure to like it. And if you haven't done it already, click the subscribe button to follow us on our weekly episodes that are coming up later on. And also leave your comments down below about any video ideas or doing some, some questions for any Q and A's, as this will help our channel and videos become more reachable. Until the next time, stay secure and become an InfoSec Defender.